All right, hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome to Beer City Breaks. Uh, we got two boxes of Legacy tonight. I'm going to apologize in advance. I'm kind of wrapping up one of my fantasy football league drafts, so you may hear some little uh, dinging in the background. Uh, it's kind of like in round, I don't even know by now, like 12, 13. So it's kind of getting down to the bottom of the barrel, but I may just kind of keep my eye on it and just see. Still need some backup running backs. Um, <laughs> hopefully y'all understand. <clears throat> but um, welcome to Beer City Breaks. My name is Aaron, coming to you from Asheville, North Carolina. <clears throat> I appreciate y'all joining tonight. Um, I may also um, kind of from time to time have to just pause to look and see if somebody else has requested to join the group. Um, but other than that, we should be good to go. Everybody paid and quickly. I appreciate that. That makes life a whole lot easier. Uh, so that means we can just jump right into the break. So let me do a couple things real quick. Hey, Mike, thanks for joining, man. All right, good deal, good deal. Let's go Falcons. You know, hopefully we'll find some Desmond Ritter. I actually went to the University of Cincinnati. I'm uh, originally from Ohio, from Cincinnati, and so I went to the University of Cincinnati, so I'm a big Desmond Ritter fan. So hopefully we can find some tonight. Uh, let me just, I uh, just got to get the team list finalized. And then, oh, let me make that a little bit bigger, just so when I switch over we can see that. All right, that should be good. And let me go ahead and get the randomizer together as well for the giveaway at the end. So many pop-ups. Let's see. Got to get all my NFL teams together real quick. Pop into the randomizer. And again, if you just joined, um, I apologize. You may hear some like some noises in the background. I'm finishing up my fantasy football, uh, one of my fantasy football league drafts. <laughs> uh, it's getting towards the end. I hardly have any money left. We do a $200, uh, you get $200 to start. Um, and I pretty much blew like, I'd say 80% of my budget in the first uh, four rounds. Well, actually probably the first two or three rounds. So, um, but I got some good players so far. I can't really complain. I got uh, Jamar Chase from my Bengals. And then I got Terry McLaurin. And then I got Nick Chubb and um, Javante Williams from our main running back. So we'll see. But I'm to the point where I've only got 12 bucks left, so pretty much anything over $2 is over my budget. So, all right. All right, good deal. Thank you, Chad, for joining. Um, Y'all, let me see real quick. I've got a couple people that are looking to join the group. So hang on one moment. Oh, no, that was just people that liked the video. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I'm still, to some extent, I'm still getting used to um, Facebook as well. All right, well, let's go ahead and jump on in. Uh, we're good to go. Everybody's paid up, so I do appreciate that. Hey, Phil, thank you for joining. I appreciate that. Excellent, excellent. Uh, go Broncos, ND. Michael, I just picked up Javante Williams tonight. I've actually got him in one of my other, one of the dynasty leagues that I had just picked up uh, this year. And so I've also uh, just picked him up tonight in one of my other fantasy football leagues. So, nice, I just picked up Michael Parsons. We do individual defensive players too, so uh, we got like, it's a huge roster of players. Let's see, let me get the camera. Sometimes it takes a little bit longer, it lags. I watch it on my phone and it does kind of lag behind a little bit. There we go, okay. So let me scroll down through the team list. Uh, the names are rather large. <laughs> Hopefully it makes it easy to see. <clears throat> But I will scroll on down through the list. And again, I just took these names from eBay. So these should look familiar. They're a little larger than they usually are. I apologize. <laughs> All right, there we go. All right, bring it back over here. Uh, tonight's giveaway is going to be a Jabril Cox, uh, red rookie out of 79, 51 out of 79 uh, for the Cowboys. So I will randomize that off at the end. Uh, if y'all give me like 30 seconds, let me uh, plug in the one thing I forgot. Let me plug in my ring light, turn off the overhead light so it doesn't bleed everything out. <clears throat> a 
Cool. Paul, I just saw your message. I appreciate that, man. Thank you for doing that. That would be great. I appreciate that. All right. Um, so, yep, there we go. We're good to go. So, the Jabril Cox will be the giveaway uh, for this year's Optic. And that is number 51079. So, at the end, I will randomize that off among the teams. All right. So, here we go. We got two boxes. Um, so, there are 16 packs per box, eight cards per pack in the Legacy. I have not opened any of these myself. I did participate in one break in a Facebook group that I'm in. So I'm looking forward to seeing what we can find. It's always hard to like have the discipline not to want to just open these up myself. So let's see what I'm going to do. Let's try this. So there's 16 packs. So we got 4, 8, 12, 16. And I got an empty box there. All right, and maybe what we'll do is let's try like four packs at a time. That might be a good way to kind of mix or to kind of, you know, do it in a way that's uh, somewhat efficient. Luckily, these have the uh, team logos on them, so the NFL team logos. I've got my cheat sheet just in case, but uh, we should be in good luck. Or we should have some, shouldn't have to reference the cheat sheet with these. That always makes it a little bit easier. All right, let me get rid of these packs real quick. Well, that's crazy. Everything is over my budget now. So anything a dollar or more. Sorry, <laughs> trying to watch this fantasy draft at the same time. All right, here we go. Thanks, Chris, for joining. First break as well. Good deal. Good to hear. Phil, go Browns. All right. I mean, I'm a Bengals fan, but all right. I mean, I can. I'll say go Browns. Yep. All right. Let's see. Starting us off, we got C.D. Lamb for the Cowboys. And we got T.J. Watt for the Steelers. Michael Pittman for the Colts. Got a Legends card for Mike Singletary for the Bears. Then we've got um, Joe Montana on the Legends as well for the 49ers. Um, Daxton Hill going to the Bengals, rookie. There we go. Safety from the first round out of Michigan. And let's see, we got Garrett Wilson uh, for the Jets. And other Jets, we got on the, like the Chrome, um, Jermaine Johnson for the Jets as well. And we got Kyler Murray, Stephon Diggs. Matt Judon, Michael Vick on the Legends, as well as Barry Sanders. And picking back up, this is like the uh, first set of packs are all about the Jets. So we got uh, Jeremy Rucker, and then we've also got Kenneth Walker. Decade of Dominance for J.J. Watt. Let me turn that volume down a little bit more. I, honestly, un unless I, uh, I think at this point, unless I nominate a player, I can't even bid on them because anything over a dollar is over my budget. <laughs> All right, we got DK Metcalf and James Robinson for the Jags. Got a Legends card for Ricky Williams for the Dolphins. And another Legends card for Ed Reed going to the Ravens. And let's see. Oh, we got a mini coming up. So we got Wandale Robinson, rookie card for the Giants. Oops, sorry, I don't want to lose these guys. There we go. We got David Bell going to the Browns there. And then we got our mini is a TJ Watt. And this one's numbered, actually. So it's a kind of a silver or hollow for the Steelers. And it is numbered. Sorry, I'm not used to handling these guys. 49 out of 75. So let me go ahead and at least get this one sleeved up. I'd say it should be pretty easy to sleeve. <laughs> and we're going to get this one at a top loader. Oh, there we go. All right, nice little hit there. TJ Watt for the Steelers to start things off. There we got Brian Urlacher on the Timeless Talents. A Cameron Jordan for the Saints. Cortland Sutton for the Broncos. Got a Legends card for Amon Green for the Packers. Eli Manning, Legends for the Giants. Got a Kenny Pickett 
rookie card there going to the Steelers. Get that one sleeved up in a moment. And let's see, we got a Velas, Velas Jones Jr. for the Bears. And then we got a Luke Keekley uh, Legends uh, for the Panthers. And this one's numbered 119 out of 150. And then we got a Time Machines Fred Taylor um, going to the Jaguars. Nice. All right, not bad. Let me go ahead and get a few of these. Oh, that's a, that's a little different sleeve there. Let me get a few of these sleeved up and top loaded real quick. And nice Luke Keekley card there, numbered out of 150 for the Panthers. I believe he was from Cincinnati or went to, to Elder, maybe. I can't remember off the top of my head, but. I think he was from a Cincinnati high school, if I remember correctly. Or maybe it was St. X, I can't remember. <clears throat> and we got a nice Kenny Pickett there. And let's see, let me get one more real quick. There we go, the Jermaine Johnson. All right, we'll jump into our next four. Yeah, this is the fantasy league I'm drafting in tonight. It's the one I've been in for probably about a decade now. So just recently, I started doing a, a draft where you get like a, a you know a budget. You get so much money to work with from the get go when you draft. So, I don't know, like most years I kind of wait too long, and then, I mean, I end up, which I guess isn't terrible, because then you have more money, you know, and everyone else has run out. This time I tried a different strategy, I just went ahead and spent everything I had early on. Alright, this one's a little thick, I guess it just has like a, maybe some kind of a chrome card in there. Alright, so our next four packs, oh, we do have a, I'll cover that one up, we do have another mini card coming up. So, starting off, we got a T-Law. For the Jags, he's actually the one I, uh, one of my quarterbacks I drafted tonight. So hoping he does well this year. Antonio Gibson for the Commanders. Got a Legends card for Warren Moon. For the Oilers, so I'll go to Tennessee. Uh, Ken Houston, also for the Oilers. Got a David Ojabo, rookie card for the Baltimore Ravens. A Matt Coral, unfortunately looks like he'll be out for the year. And we do have something backwards, I believe. So it looks like we should have an autograph coming up. So let's see what we got. Autograph guaranteed. HFSRG. Let's see. Ray Guy. Looks like that's going to be a vet. Well, retired, I guess, at this point. So that's interesting. Ray Guy going to the Raiders. So a team maybe doesn't always get a whole lot of hits. So get a little love tonight. So this one's numbered uh, 67 out of 100. Very interesting. All right, on the Hall of Fame. Nice looking card. So we should get two autographs. Knock on wood, of course, as Panini says, on average. But we should get two autographs. So nice hit there going out to the Raiders. Ray Guy, looks like I'm guessing a kicker, punter. I'm not familiar. The name sounds vaguely familiar, but... All right, and then we got Drew Brees on the Time Machines. We've got Xavier Howard for the Dolphins. Jamar Chase there for the Bengals. Got a Randall Cunningham, Legends, going to the Eagles. Peyton Manning, Legends, going to the Colts. Then we got a Sky Moore. For the Chiefs, Skyden Hutchinson, rookie card. I'll get that one sleeved up and top loaded in a moment. And our next mini is a Kenny Pickett. Man, Steelers are doing pretty well so far, especially on these minis. And I will say, as is the custom with Panini, uh, there are a couple of little minor imperfections. A couple little dots down here in the bottom. So, I tell you, you know, Panini never 
fails to uh, miss on the quality control. So there we go. But nice card overall, though. Not bad there. For the Steelers. I'm going to go ahead and get that one sleeved up and top loaded real quick. All right, continuing on, we got a Generations card for Dak Prescott and Troy Aikman going to Dallas. Uh, Tyreek Hill, James Conner, got a Legends for Clinton Portis for the Broncos. Jerry Rice on the Legends card. Uh, Jordan Davis um, for the Eagles. Chris Olave for the Saints. We got a Joe Burrow. Nice card for the Bengals. Uh, number, number two, actually. 002 out of 299. Nice card there for the Bengals. Get that one sleeved and top loaded in a moment. Uh, time Machines for John Elway for the Broncos. Got Josh Jacobs, David Montgomery, Danny Dimes, Daniel Jones, um, Shannon Sharp on the Legends for the Broncos. Rondé Barber for the Bucks on the Legends card. And then we got uh, Danny Gray going to San Francisco. Alec Pierce going to the Colts, another Bearcat. And we got Aiden Hutchinson, nice, on the, um, I guess, the silver. So not numbered, but looks like the silver version. All right. Wait one second. That doesn't even make any sense. Okay, I did get James Cook. Sorry. I was trying to look at this uh, fantasy football draft. Put me on auto draft, but then I picked a player and it said uh, it was over my budget, but I guess they still, they still gave it to me, so that's good. James Cook for Buffalo. I guess Dalvin Cook's brother, so we'll see how that one works out. <clears throat> All right, let me get a couple more sleeved up real quick. So nice, uh, nice hit there for the Bengals. Definitely, as a former Cincinnatian, still my, still my team. So that is a nice looking card there. Number two out of two ninety nine. Good deal. All right, let's see. Put him over here. Let me actually bring that up a little bit. There we go. All right, so we'll do our next four. So we should have one more autograph coming. <clears throat> so I don't have any more breaks uh, till next week. Actually, I haven't put anything up yet. I'm going to probably might do two breaks next weekend. So I do have... I did uh, go out and get some um, 2022 Prestige Blasters. I had five, but I wanted to go ahead and get uh, five more to do a break with ten. So I'll put those up either probably for Sunday. I do have 20 Optic um, Football Blasters coming from Target. And those should be here hopefully by Wednesday, Thursday. So I'm going to try to go ahead and put one up for Saturday night with those. So keep an eye out on the uh, eBay page. I'll also put up an announcement too on Facebook whenever I do uh, put the auctions up for those. All right, so here we go. We got Jalen Waddell, Russell Wilson, looking good in the Broncos uniform. A little Photoshop action going on there. And let's see, I'm gonna turn all of these upside down actually. Uh, we've got Darius Leonard for the Colts, a Legends for Brett Favre for the Packers. Uh, Legends Keyshawn Johnson for the Bucks. Then we got a Jahan Dotson, or Jahan Dotson, sorry, uh, going to Washington. Trent McDuffie going to Kansas City. Got a For the Ages, Mike Ditka going to the Bears. Patty Mahomes going to the Chiefs. DeAndre Hopkins for the Cards. And we got Bo Jackson on the Legends, one of my favorite players growing up. Luke Keekley for the Panthers on the Legends card. We got Brees Hall for the Jets. 
Uh, Jaquan Brisker for Chicago. And it looks like we got an autograph card. And it's a nice one. George Karloftis for Kansas City. So that's a nice looking card there. On the, I guess, the silver variant. But a nice hit there for Kansas City. Hey, let's see. We got a decade of dominance for Champ Bailey for the 2000s, it looks like. And a Jerry Judy. Tyler Lockett. A Legends for Jim Kelly for the Bills. Legends for Steve Atwater for the Broncos. Looks like we got a blue bordered card, probably a numbered card coming up. We got Romeo Dobbs for Green Bay. And followed by Christian Watson, another uh, rookie wide receiver for Green Bay. Hey, here we got a Patty Mahomes going to the Chiefs. And this one is numbered out of 50. 28 out of 50. So nice hit there. Boy, this is... Uh, these were the Chiefs packs. A nice little hit there for Kansas City. All right, and the rest of these three pack or four packs, rather, we got Jerome Bettis on the Timeless Talents, a Terry McLaurin, who I picked up tonight in my fantasy draft for Washington, got a Deshaun Watson for the Browns, still in the Texans uniform, but we'll go to the Browns because that's the text on there. Uh, Justin Fields for the Bears. I tried to snag him tonight in my fantasy league along with uh, Trey Lance, but I'd already blown my budget, so I couldn't snag either one of them. Uh, we got Nick Mangold for the Jets on the Legends. Eddie George as well. Got a Bailey Zapp for New England. Another George Karloftis for Kansas City. And we got it under the lights for Isaiah Spiller. And that should go to the Chargers. Some of these, uh, some of these guys are finally starting to sink in my head as far as what teams they go to. All right, then we got our last set of four from our first box. Um, one other thing I may try tomorrow. I'm still thinking about it. You know, I know the the group is still fairly small in terms of the number of members, but. Um, I do have a box of the Prestige H2. I was going to do this with some blasters like I did the last time, but I thought maybe I'd try something different. I'm thinking I might try to put and do a break through the group, um, and I'll put it up tomorrow uh, afternoon or evening, where maybe it'd be like a divisional break. Uh, so it'd be eight divisions, obviously, and I would do it randomly. So I'd have the names, I'd randomize the names, and then I'd randomize the teams, and then match them up with the names. Um, so keep an eye out on the Facebook page tomorrow. I mean, it's not necessarily something that would have to fill super fast, so we'd have a little bit of time uh, to work with it. But uh, I don't know. Figure it might be worth a try. Something different. All right, we got Saquon Barkley for the Giants, Javante Williams for the Broncos, Trey Lance, 49ers. Still kind of funny after doing so much 2021 product to see these guys, uh, these second-year players, without a rookie card designation. Drew Pearson for the Cowboys on the Legends. Brian Urlacher on the Legends for Chicago. Got an Evan Neal going to New York Giants. Uh, Isaiah Spiller going to the Chargers. Got Chris Olave on the, the Chrome. Then we got Chase Young going to the Commanders. Darren Waller for the Raiders. Darnell Mooney for the Bears. Got a Deuce McAllister. Going to the Saints on the Legends car. Dan Fouts for the Chargers. Got a Kyler Gordon going to the Bears. And then we got a Tyron Davis Price going to the 49ers. And we got an orange bordered car. So I'm guessing another numbered car. We got For the Ages. This is for Flipper Anderson for the Rams. I don't think I've heard that name in a while. We've got Kirk Cousins for the Vikings, Joe Mixon for the Bengals, Jalen Hurts for the Eagles, 
a Legends for Tony Romo. Carson Palmer, Legends for the Bengals. Got a Malik Willis. There we go. For Tennessee. Tyler Betty, Batty for Baltimore. Then we got a Dominance, Decorative Dominance card for Earl Campbell from the 70s. Looks like Travis Kelsey, Matt Ryan. And this will go to the Colts, even though he's in the uh, Falcons uniform still. Because it's got the Colts down at the bottom. Then we've got a John Elway on the Legends. John Randall for the Vikings. Kayvon Thibodeau for the Giants. Devin Lloyd for the Jags. And we got Justin Jefferson going to the Vikings out of 199. So 119 out of 199. And ending the first box with the Timeless Talents for Christian McCaffrey. Not too bad. So not too bad for the first box there. We got, what, I think three, actually four, because one of the minis was numbered. So four numbered cards, two autographs. So not bad. Two of the mini cards as well. So not a bad way to start things off. Let's see if Malik Willis gets any playing time this year. I guess it would have to be either uh, Ryan Tannehill getting injured or just doing incredibly poorly but I like Malik Willis I'm kind of you know I'm rooting for him eventually when he gets to that point where he's ready to start there we go uh, let's see Get him there in the middle all right box number two So yeah, I went around to all the Walmarts around me. There's four of them that are fairly close. Just to see if I could find any optic this weekend in store. So we got an empty box there. And let's see, we got four, eight, 12, and 16. But yeah, I didn't, uh, couldn't find any optic uh, in the wild. Unfortunately, I was a little bummed. I went to one store that's like halfway between work and home. Oops. Uh, and I got there like 7.45 in the morning and thought, hey, this will be a good. I'll have a better chance maybe if they're stocking. And by that point, the vendor was finishing up and somebody had already been there and gone. Um, had already wiped out all the optic. I think there were supposed to be some prism hangers as well. And I didn't see those either. So that was a bummer. And then Friday after work, stopped by the closest Walmart to my home, and they had evidently stopped during the day and everything was gone. So, unfortunately, out of luck. So we'll see. Um, I've heard that this coming week, this next week, that Walmart should be getting the uh, Optic uh, Mega Boxes. So that might be something to keep an eye out if you uh, have some Walmarts near you. And then also hoping, hoping maybe we'll see some of that at Target online this week. So Tuesday mornings is usually when Target does their drops. Um, so hopefully, hopefully we'll see something. I'm sure it'll be kind of hard to get. I've also seen some cello packs loaded as well. So we will see. Hopefully I'll be able to get something uh, we can do some breaks with. All right, next box starting off, we got Tua and Robert Quinn for the Bears. Kenny Galladay for the Giants. And let's see, we got a Legends for Brett Favre, another Legends for Keyshawn Johnson. Uh, Jalen Tolbert, rookie card, going to Dallas. Trayvon Walker going to the Jags, number one overall pick. Uh, William Perry, Refrigerator Perry, going to the Bears on the four of the ages. We got Devontae Smith. Oh, okay, there we go. Do have an autograph coming up, so let me. Uh, I don't want to manhandle that one. Got Devonte Smith, Aaron Jones, got a Bo Jackson Legends, Luke Keekley Legends, Trey McBride. Guy was hoping the Bengals might actually get for the cards. Then a Sam Howell going to Washington, and autograph for Christian Watson. All right, not bad. 
Going to the Packers. Definitely curious to see what he can do this year. I guess him and Romeo Dobbs, just to see what, uh, you know, I mean, seems like there's a little bit of uh, potential vacuum there for uh, the Packers wide receivers. Uh, some of these rookies hopefully get a chance to step up. Give me one second. Let me see. It's my turn to draft team defenses. That's what I'm looking for. Yep, looks like I auto drafted the Packers defense. So, <laughs> oh well. All right, so nice hit there for the Packers. Good deal. All right, and let's see, we got a decade of dominance going to Michael Strahan for the 2000s, a Dalvin Cook going to the Vikings, Cordell Patterson for the Falcons, Jim Kelly Legends for the Bills, Steve Atwater, Broncos. I feel like we've seen this uh, before. We got a uh, rookie card for Andrew Booth going to the Vikings, cornerback out of Clemson. And then we got Drake London going to the Falcons there. Got a Devin Lloyd rookie numbered going to the Jags. This is number, let's see, 86 out of 299. That one's sleeved up in a moment. We got the Timeless Talents for Marcus Allen for the Raiders. Miles Sanders for the Eagles. Brandon Cooks. Got a Legends for Clinton Portis. And a Legends for Jerry Rice going to the 49ers. And then a Carson Strong going to the Eagles. Derek Stingley going to the Houston Texans got another numbered card looks like another chief and this time it is Travis Kelsey and it's 14 out of 199 and we got another decade of dominance for the 2010s for Tom Brady let me go ahead and get that one sleeved up and top loaded as well four packs yeah definitely ready for football season as a Cincinnati sports fan the Reds have not been relevant for <laughs> most of the season and now that the trade deadline is coming gone and there's not really a whole lot of excitement Joey Votto's out for the rest of the season now I mean they traded away or have so many guys that are injured at this point so definitely ready for football so only a couple more weeks really i do have a, a box on pre-order of the i guess it's the elite for 2022 it's not supposed to come out till like the second week of september but at some point that'll come in so i'll pop that up for a break as well Oh, looks like we got another mini card in there, so let's see. All right, so the next set of four packs, we're starting off with Najee Harris for the Steelers. Not necessarily a Steelers fan, being a Bengals fan, but I do like Najee Harris. Uh, we got Davis Mills, Legends for John Randall for the Vikings. We got a Tony Romo, Legends. Another Villas Jones Jr. for the Bears. Wandale Robinson for the Giants. And for the Bengals, a couple numbered cards now for the Bengals. We got a Daxton Hill, number 62 out of 100. Looks like he is poised to replace Jesse Bates, who still seems to be holding out, I guess, at this point. We got a Generations card for Jamar Chase and Chad Johnson, also for the Bengals. Saquon Barkley, Javante, Trey Lance. Got a Mike Singletary on the Legends for the Bears. 
and a Ty Law Legends for the Patriots. Got a Jerome Ford going to the Browns, another Cincinnati Bearcat, and Kyron Williams going to the Rams. Okay, let's see. We got the mini in there, so I'm trying not to I want that one to slip out. All right, we got Traylon Burks under the lights going to Tennessee. Chase Young going to the Commanders. Darren Waller. Darnell Mooney. Got a Legends for Michael Vick. Going to the Falcons. Uh, Legends for Barry Sanders. Going to Detroit. James Cook for Buffalo. Newest member of my fantasy football team. Let's see. Hang on one second. Let me... I don't even know. It's my turn to draft, but I don't even know like how to nominate. It won't let me. All right. Sorry about that. Brian Robinson going to Washington. And we got a Time Machines for Phillip Rivers for the Chargers. Mike Evans for the Buccaneers. A Joey B for the Bengals. Got a Legends for Randall Cunningham for the Eagles. Peyton Manning for the Colts. Then let's see. Damian Pierce. Price. Let's see. Pierce. Damian Pierce going to the Texans. A Pierre Strong. Going to the Pats. And let's see, we got a Darius Leonard going to the Colts for our next mini. Again, a couple little teeny tiny like pinpricks right over here. Nothing terrible, just a little surface stuff. But still, a little frustrating. And let's see, we've got a For the Ages for Marcus Allen for the Raiders there. All right, let me get a few of these sleeved up and top loaded. Yeah, I wonder if we'll get any of those uh, dare to rip or... I don't know, we'll see. be interesting to see if we get any of those. Have the hidden mini cards inside. can't remember the player off the top of my head now, but I do remember seeing something on Facebook where somebody had done one of those uh, Dare to Rip cards, and I think they got some kind of a one of one, maybe, one of those gold vinyl, I think it was. I can't remember the player though off the top of my head, unfortunately. Bengals not doing too bad. A couple numbered cards. All right, so we got eight packs left. There we go. And I did do a uh, like a mini helmet break a few weeks ago, and I think uh, I'm gonna do another uh, memorabilia break. Um, probably not for maybe two weeks, but I just ordered a bunch of stuff from RSA, and I got a couple other different uh, companies like mystery helmet and or jersey products. So I'm thinking probably in two weekends I may go ahead and do that, but it'd be a 10 item break. And it'd be a mix of like um, helmets, or mini helmets, uh, footballs, and jerseys. But I like to I like participating in memorabilia breaks, um, and so I thought you know, kind of branch out a little bit, try some different things. So keep an eye out for those as well. All right, we got Leonard Fournette for the Bucks, Matt Stafford, uh, Elijah Moore for the Jets. Then we got a Legends for Joe Montana. Carson Palmer, Legends again. David Bell on the rookie card for the Browns. Got Jeremy Ruckert for the Jets. Time Machines for Anquan Bolden. And then Aaron Rodgers, Nick Bosa, 
Justin Herbert. Got a Deuce McAllister on the Legends. A Dan Fouts for the Chargers. Then Kenneth Walker. Sounds like he's dealing with an injury, unfortunately. I've got him in one of my fantasy leagues. Got a Dax Hill again for the Bengals. And a Timeless Talents for Tiki Barber for the Giants. And we got Lamar Jackson, Justin Jefferson, Nick Chubb, Drew Pearson on the Legends, Brian Urlacher again on the Legends, got Garrett Wilson for the Jets, Taquan Thornton for the Pats, got a Christian Watson, DeAndre Swift, Debo, Travis Kelsey, Nick Mangold on the Legends for the Jets, Eddie George Legends, a rookie for John Mechie III. Unfortunately, he'll be out this season, but uh, hopefully, sounds like pretty good prognosis for him uh, for his cancer diagnosis, so hopefully he can beat that and come back next year. Got an Ahmad Gardner, another Cincinnati Bearcat there, for the Jets, and Danny Gray going to San Francisco. At least get just a few of these sleeved up real quick. And as a Cincinnati Bearcat alumnus, it was very nice to see them do so well last year. Obviously, quite a bit of talent um, departed last year, but I like Luke Fickle though, so hopefully he'll be able to uh, do some good things. And hopefully, you know, at least uh, Cincinnati's kind of status or stock, so to speak, has uh, increased in the eyes of uh, potential players. So hopefully they'll have a uh, you know, better chance to recruit. All right, so we got our last four packs from box number two. Good luck, everyone. Once we get done with these, we'll go ahead and do a quick recap, and we'll do the giveaway. So should have one more autograph coming. Good luck, everybody. Starting off, we got Matt Ryan for the Colts, Kirk Cousins, Amon Green on the Legends, Eli Manning on the Legends as well. Got a yellow coming up, should be numbered. Jameson Williams, rookie card, going to Detroit. Then Isaiah Likely going to Baltimore. And we do have a numbered card for Jalen Waddell for the Dolphins there, number 138 out of 150. Get that one sleeved up in a moment. And let's see, Phil Sims on the Time Machines. Joe Mixon for the Bengals. Got something uh, pinky, pink or purple coming up. Got a Jalen Hurts, Ricky Williams, Ed Reed. There's a Desmond Ritter for the Falcons. And we got Kyle Hamilton for Baltimore. Looks like it's our next mini. And this one is for Kenneth Walker. I'm assuming, yep, numbered. Oh, five out of five. All right, nice hit for the Seahawks there. So that one is numbered five out of five. Let's see, kind of hard to, kind of hard to see it, but it is five out of five. So that's a nice looking card there. It's got like, the, I guess it's like a cracked ice, kind of a pink, purple cracked ice there. Cool, not bad. Something a little unexpected there. Yeah, hopefully he can get back. Uh, Sound like maybe it was a hamstring injury that was uh, bugging him. So hopefully he can get back soon. I figure with Rashad Penny, I mean, he's uh, always kind of injury prone. So, you know, Kenneth Walker should have a decent chance. All right, continuing on, we got a Generations card for Justin Herbert and Dan Fouts. Got a Zach Wilson, 
TJ Hawkinson, Legends for Warren Moon, Ken Houston for the Oilers. We've seen that, that combination before. Looks like we've got our autograph card coming up. Uh, Hassan Haskins for Tennessee, Khalil Shakir for Buffalo, and let's see. So our next autograph card is Trey McBride going to the Cardinals. Tight end going to the Cardinals. Again, a guy I was kind of hoping would slip to the Bengals so that they would grab. I'm glad at least they got Hayden Hurst this year to make up for the loss of Uzama, but not bad. Be interesting to see uh, how much time he gets uh, with Zach Ertz ahead of him on the depth chart. All right, we got Shannon Sharp on the Time Machines, George Kittle. Flip these up for side down. George Kittle. We got Clyde Edwards Hilaire. Kyle Pitts. Shannon Sharp Legends. Rondé Barber Legends. One of the Bucks. A Drake Jackson going to San Francisco. George Pickens going to the Steelers. And then we got a David Bell. And this one goes to the Browns. So kind of on the uh, silver. Again, kind of some little, little pin size. Marks you can kind of see through there, unfortunately. I would say Panini needs to do a better job with their quality control, but Panini probably just doesn't care anymore. <laughs> I don't know. With the impending change to Fanatics, I don't know. It's almost uh, kind of like Panini's just doing a little money grab. I don't know if they're really too concerned anymore about uh, things like quality control. Unless maybe it's a high-end product. All right, let me go ahead and get two more of these uh, sleeved up and top-loaded. Then we'll do a quick recap. So not bad. It's pretty good autographs. Nice numbered cards in there. I like that numbered five out of five for the Seattle Seahawks. All right. Well, let's do a quick recap. Yeah, Paul, indeed. That was a, that's a really nice looking card there. And that one looks, I mean, it looks pretty good too. The surface uh, doesn't, you know, doesn't seem to have any real issues with it either. So that's a nice looking card. All right, so let's do the quick recap and then we'll do the giveaway. So we had the Decade of Dominance 2010 for Tom Brady, David Bell on the silver. We got Trey McBride, autograph. Dax Hill for the Bengals, numbered out of 100. Jalen Waddell, numbered out of 150. Desmond Ritter, rookie card. Generations for Dan Fouts and Justin Herbert. Christian Watson, rookie card. Got a Generations for Jamar Chase and Chad Johnson. We got the Darius Leonard on the mini. Kenneth Walker, rookie card, base. Traylon Burks, under the lights. Got Devin Lloyd going to the Jags, numbered out of 299. Travis Kelsey, 14 out of 199 for the Chiefs. Christian Watson. Going to Green Bay. Chris Olave. Got Patty Mahomes out of 50 for the Chiefs. Justin Jefferson for the Vikes out of 199. Uh, George Carl Optus, autograph card for the Chiefs. Malik Willis on the base. Uh, Hall of Fame, numbered out of 100 for Ray Guy, autograph card for the Raiders. We got Under the Lights for Isaiah Spiller for the Chargers. Joey B, number 2 out of 299 for the Bengals. Had the Kenny Pickett's um, mini rookie card. Hayden Hutchinson on the silver rookie for Detroit. Uh, we got Kenny Pickett for the Steelers. Jermaine Johnson for the Jets. Numbered out of 150. We got a Luke Keekley Legends card. We got the TJ Watt mini um, out of 75 for the Steelers. Fred Taylor on the Time Machines. And then our five of five. Kenneth Walker on the mini. So not bad, not bad at all. <clears throat> all right, so let's do the giveaway. And the giveaway tonight is gonna be uh, Jabril Cox uh, from this year's Optic, and it is numbered 51 out of 79. So let me go ahead and bring the camera over. Uh, I will probably get these all packaged up tomorrow night, and so they should go out to the post office on Tuesday. Um, so that's my goal. So we'll roll the dice here, we've got five, and then come over to the randomizer. 
And I've got all of the teams loaded up in there. So we'll go ahead and do um, five times in the randomizer. And whichever team is on top at the end will get the giveaway card. Four and five. So real quick, just to show it was done five times. And go to the top. And it looks like the Bills. The Bills will get the giveaway card. So nice. All right. Well, I do appreciate y'all joining tonight. Uh, again, um, I will make announcements through the Facebook uh, page whenever I've got new breaks going up. Um, I will try to do tomorrow. I'll post something just to see if we can get it going. Uh, do a divisional break for the Prestige H2 box. So we'll see if there's some interest there. I'm thinking maybe like 31 per spot, so $31 uh, per division, and we do it randomly. So you know, I'd put the names in the randomizer, randomize them, and then randomize the divisions, and then match them up. Um, so if you're interested in that, check that out. I'll do a quick tag um, tomorrow when I do that. But again, I do appreciate y'all joining tonight. Uh, we'll get these packaged up tomorrow, drop them off at the post office on Tuesday, and I hope to see y'all in a future break. Uh, but thank y'all so much, and I hope y'all have a great week.